Guys often ask if I could interview or film top riders more, but I'm not really all that interested. Yes, they are amazing riders. Yes, the majority of them are very likeable people. But one of the things I like about social media is that it celebrates the everyday hero. Hey Barry, how are you doing Barry? <laughs> sure, I get a thrill when I see someone like Tim Coleman do a ridiculous stunt. But I actually get more of a thrill when I see my riding buddies doing well. When Andrew finally nails a tough hill climb, or say Melissa finally gets those pivot turns working nicely. Oh, the control, the poise, the grace, the balance. I'm guessing Karate Kid, the sequel? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was a common theme when chatting with a lot of the traction e rag guys in Canada. And I got their big cheese to expound on this in one of the basement sessions. Oh my god, it's the Welshman in all his splendour. <laughs> How does this happen? All in one piece. How does this happen? <laughs> People always come up to us and say, oh man, your magazine is so crazy. It's so cool. It's so different than what's out there. And I, I agree. Um, and we didn't intentionally set out to make it that way. It just turned out that way. Everywhere you look, it's young racers and all these young men doing winning championships and all that stuff. And I'm just simply, you know, in my mid 40s, I'm just not inspired by that anymore. I'm never going to be a racer. I don't aspire to be a racer. I want to be something different. And what we've decided to do is take the average Joe. Super Dave, what's oh. your secret power? Well, a big help for me is Fuji. You know, he, he orchestrates all my stunts for me. So it makes it all quite easy in the long run. Everyday people who have everyday lives and uh, turn them into heroes. So we're in the business of making everyday heroes. And I think those are people that, at least guys like me or people involved in the Traction E-Rag, we can be inspired by that rather than, you know, manufactured heroes. Uh, heroes that are created by an industry driven to sell product. It's hard to be inspired by that. And if you examine it, it becomes quite evident. They're, they're manufactured stories designed to sell product. And uh, we just thought the average everyday people who ride dirt bikes on the weekends to have fun with their friends, they're much more authentic and inspiring than the alternative. Wow. At the Traction e -Rag, it's very important for us that we harvest stories from the field. And typically, these are people who have never written a story before. They wanted to write or they, you know, always thought about it, didn't think they were good enough or they don't have enough experience. And um, what we usually get are these raw stories from actually real people and uh, who ride dirt bikes for fun on the weekends with their friends. So that's why we celebrate the everyday hero.